Um, I can tell you next week there's kind of some differing opinions in the model data that we look at. Is it going to be warm or is it going to be cold? So stay tuned. So just it might ready. be warm, no. it might be cold. Either way it goes. Rain, yeah. wait and listen to you. <laughs> That's right. I do, I do know it's going to rain tomorrow. You are 100% right. Yes. It's going to be warm or it's going to be cold. It's going to be warm or it's going to be cold. <laughs> hey, I'm also 100% right. It's going to be a really nice sunset. Oh, that's gorgeous already. Look, at, Look that. at that. This is Greenfield uh, from our a Hancock County a Regional Hospital camera. It is going to be a really nice sunset. And there's a view of Monument Circle that will be lit up a week from Friday. 49 degrees in the capital city now. Winds are southeast at 7. Today's high temperature 51. That's closer to where we should be for this time of year. The average is 53. It was cold this morning. Our low dropped to 32. No rain, no snow today, but that changes tomorrow. Grab the umbrellas for a wet Wednesday. Damp to start at 9 a.m. for 43, rain and wind, 1 p.m., 46, breezy and 48 this time tomorrow. The heaviest rain will be pushing out. Temperatures in the range of 45 to 50 degrees tomorrow. We're in the clear now, but clouds will be on the increase over the next couple of hours. And you can see this weather system still developing out to our west. It will start to move our way over the next few hours. Out and about this evening, it will be dry with rain chances beginning to increase as we get to sunrise on Wednesday. This is Future Track 13, 7 a.m. tomorrow. There will be rain, especially from Indianapolis west, and then that rain will become heavy at times, especially mid to late morning. This is 10 a.m. with Future Track 13. We'll stop it at midday. It's going to be a soggy lunch hour on Wednesday. Windy, too. Those winds will be out of the south-southwest, 15 to 25 miles per hour. Heaviest rain will be across the eastern half of the state, 2 o'clock tomorrow afternoon, and then the steadiest rain will move out. I still think there will be a few showers around late in the day through at least the early Early evening hours before this weather system exits the state completely, and that will happen tomorrow night. As we look ahead with Future Track 13, it moves out. We get a dry day on Thursday, still monitoring a developing storm system for the end of the week. Right now, Thursday is dry. Looks like a good part of Friday will be dry. All eyes doesn't look like much on a developing storm system out to our west. This will impact us, especially late Friday into the start of the weekend. That's the timeline so far. Rain and storms arrive late in the day. Friday will keep you posted on the timeline. Still could be some changes. Rain and gusty winds will be threats into Saturday. Wind gusts of 40 miles per hour or more. Stay tuned for some updates on the timeline and that potential for any strong to severe storms as we get closer to the end of the week. A wet Wednesday and 48. Brighter day Thursday will be dry. You do get some dry hours Friday before that weather system arrives. Temperatures will actually climb Friday night into early Saturday before moving in the, the other direction, Saturday night into Sunday. In comparison, we go from 63 Saturday to 36 on Sunday, but that 63 will happen early in the day. Sean Ash will have more on that at 530.